Hello guys, welcome you to Lajipo Entertainment and this is your boy speaking here. This is Lajipo speaking to you here. Uh, we have come back with another update for you today and we believe we like it so very much. We believe we like it. Uh, in today's video, we are going to show you what is going on in Apple's Ayababalola burial ground today. Although the man have died 62 years ago, but there is something that is going on in this burial ground today. But before you show you that, if you haven't subscribed to this channel before, kindly click the red subscription button appearing on the video screen. And also click the notification bell icon just to receive a notification whenever I release a new video to this channel. Don't miss out. Don't be left out. Join our subscriber today at Live for Entertainment. Alright. 62 years after the death of Joseph Ayo Babalala. Here is what people usually do at his graveyard. You see, a lot of things are happening in our society. People celebrate and worship some special things. In the same way, some people are respected. They are very special that even after death, they will still be remembered. There are things that we will always keep on remembering, no matter how long those things have left us. All right. In our country, many great men have come and gone. They have made impact on many lives and as such, they will still be remembered forever. For example, some organizations and people use status to remember those people. Joseph Ayodele Babalala was the first general evangelist of CAC, that is the Christ Apostolic Church in Nigeria. The mighty man of God was gifted with healing powers, which was the most important and prominent thing in his ministry then. He died in the year 1958, that is 62 years ago. It's such a long time ago, but today many people still call his name while praying into water. But what we are going to show you today uh, is what people are actually doing in his prayer grant today. Something worthy to be noted is about his burial ground, which is still active to date. Although many people have died, there are so many people that even died after Babalala that their graveyard is not even where to be found today. But because of the impact of this man, because of the impact that he made when he was in the world, his burial ground is still very, very active, very plenty today. Although the man had died 62 years ago, yet people still go to his burial ground to pray and receive healing. And what people usually do is to take water to the place and pray on it, hoping that they will receive healing. You can see in the piece, you can see in the piece appearing on your screen, you can see how people place so many waters on his burial ground. Look at bells, look at bells, look at water. Those are what Babalala used to use for healing when he was still in the world. When he was ministering in the world, these are what these are the materials that he used to use. He used to make use of bell for healing and water. You can receive your own miracle there. Take a cup of water and pray to God using the prophet name and have faith. God will definitely do it. There are so many questions coming up today. So many people are criticizing the fact that people are praying on Babalala's burial ground. Some people said that people are worshipping him instead of worshipping God. But me, I don't really think people are worshipping him. I think people are only using his name as a point of contact to talk to God. What do you think about this? Are people really using his name to talk to God or are they worshipping him as a small God? Kindly drop your comment at the comment section of this video. That is all we have for you today. Drop a comment in the comment section of this video so that you know your opinion about this very issue that is trending now. Drop a comment, like this video, and also share it to your loved ones. Alright, we are going out there to get another update for you. See you in our next video. But before we go, kindly click the red subscription button to subscribe to this channel so that whenever we release a new video to this channel, YouTube will easily notify you. Thank you. See you in our next video.